Since 2005, astronomers have struggled to understand Enceladus's fissures, known as tiger stripes, through which ocean water erupts from the moon's icy surface. But new research explains how these so-called tiger stripes formed. These stripes, about 35 kilometers apart, are located only at the moon's south pole and they are unlike any features found on other icy moons. What makes them especially interesting is that they are continually erupting with water ice even as we speak. Scientists have developed computer models to investigate the physical forces acting on Enceladus that allow tiger stripe fissures to form and remain in place. The eccentric orbit of Enceladus causes the moon to experience internal heating. Because its distance from Saturn varies, the planet's gravity slightly deforms the moon. This process creates heat and keeps it from freezing completely. And that's why Enceladus can maintain liquid water underneath its icy crust. This gravitationally induced deformation is felt most strongly at the poles, where the ice is thinnest. During periods of gradual cooling on Enceladus, some of the moon's subsurface ocean got frozen beneath the caps. And because water expands when it freezes, as the icy crust thickens from below, the pressure in the underlying ocean increases until the ice shell eventually splits open, causing fissures to appear at the South Pole. The researchers found that the cracks stay open and continue to erupt in part because of the tidal effects of Saturn's gravity, which changes with the Moon's strange orbit. The fissures can continue to widen and narrow, bringing water through them, and this prevents them from closing up again. According to the models, the tiger stripes could only happen on a moon with a mass of Enceladus, which measures roughly 500 kilometers in diameter. <laughs>